Well, finally tonight, Tommy Lee Gillard was diagnosed with autism when she was four, and her mother was told not to expect too much from her daughter. Tony Johnson did not listen. A diagnosis a quarter century ago produced a determination to reach a deserving destination just to be seen. And as Brad Johansson shows us, Tommy Lee is being seen. At the Open Door Art Studio in Columbus, Tommy Lee, she's kind of a big deal. I constantly expose Tommy to everything, to the arts, treat her like a typical person. Tony said the doctors told her that her daughter probably wouldn't be able to communicate much, if at all. To her, that just meant Tommy would be different. I like to call it different abilities and special abilities. That's why we focus on what Tommy, her strengths and what she can do versus what she can't do. What she can do is paint. It blew me away, it blew everyone away. Right, Tommy right, Lee? Tommy. In 2019, Tommy Lee had her own show. It was the very first time that the King Arts Complex ever featured an artist with a developmental disability for a solo exhibition. Tommy loves music and draws the artists that move her, from Aaliyah to the Isley Brothers. More art shows are planned, maybe even a tour, Tony says. Tommy's done a little open door theater as well. You like dressing up in character, right? Right. With yeah. the makeup, and she loves just to, to model, right? Yeah. Well, blowing a kiss. Ah, the modeling. Tony says that's where Tommy Lee transforms into Dorothy Dandridge or whoever she wants to be that day for the camera. You rarely see images of African American females. You rarely see a lot of males, but not of a lot of African-American females. Why do you think that is? I'm not really sure. Tony's now hoping that a mainstream company like Abercrombie & Fitch or Victoria's Secret, who just named its first Down Syndrome model, will make Tommy Lee the next cover girl. She represents diversity, inclusion, communities that are underrepresented. So it's our time, it's their time. Limits, Tony says, are lies. After writing a book about their journey, art shows, and a budding modeling career, the only question for this now 29-year-old is what's next? I just, I wouldn't want to change who she is because she brings something special to everyone. Right, Tommy Lee? Tommy. Are you happy? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. I'm just, I just feel blessed. I just feel like I couldn't imagine it being any other way. And if you'd like to share any of the stories we featured tonight, see previous episodes of the Autism Puzzle, you'll find them at NBC4i.com. Thanks so much for joining us tonight for the Autism Puzzle. Good night.